Hey guys, welcome back to another video and look how cold it is on my island today. We're officially in December now. So I'm here with my monthly checklist as usual. December is a super, super busy month. So we're going to try and break it down, see what's coming, see what we need to kind of get involved with. So you do not miss anything, any of the exciting goodness. So as always, we're going to start with the brand new bugs and fish and sea creatures for the month. So for anybody who's playing in the Northern Hemisphere like myself, we haven't got a ton of new stuff because we are moving into those colder months now. So we've got things like the Emperor Butterfly, um, the Pond Smelt, the String Fish, the Sea Butterfly. Not very extensive, just a few new things kind of making a return. For you guys in the Southern Hemisphere, you're obviously moving into the summer now, which is super exciting. So you've got tons and tons and tons of new stuff coming. So things like the Emperor Butterfly, the Fireflies, which look amazing. Um, all the sharks come in. So you've got the Great White, the Hammerhead, all the good stuff there. And then in terms of the sea creatures, you've got things like the Sea Grapes, Tiger Prawns, Sea Pineapple, things like that. So plenty of stuff that you can be, cl you know, can be ticking off your Critopedia if you need them still. Now, we're going to move into events for the month. And December, like I said, is pretty damn jam-packed. So, I'm going to start kind of going through, in a sort of a chronological order, what's coming up. So, you try, you try not to miss anything. So, 14th of December, we've got the Winter fishy to Fishing Tournament. The prizes are still the same. So, if you've got them all and you're not that bothered, obviously, it's not a big deal. But if you've not played, if you're new to the game, it's quite a fun event. So, give it a try. From the 15th of December, for everybody, we've got the ornaments that are going to become available as a seasonal DIY, uh, seasonal material. So the cedar trees will start to kind of light up and you'll have super cool little light up trees. If you shake them, they'll drop ornaments and there's three different coloured ornaments available. And they are used to make some of the Christmas DIYs, so keep an eye out for them. They run from the 15th of December to the 6th of January. For anybody who's playing in the Northern Hemisphere, we also have the snowflakes that will be making an appearance. The so same as the maple leaves and the cherry blossoms. You catch them with a net. So just keep an eye out for those. For you guys playing in the Southern Hemisphere, you will be getting the summer shells. So you'll find them on your beach and as you're walking along, there's like a blue shell that'll pop up. You can get about three a day if you're lucky. I have done a full video on this previously. So if you haven't seen it already, check back and look at that. And then moving on to the 24th is Toy Day. So Jingle's going to be making an appearance. I'm going to do a whole separate video on Toy Day. So again, you know exactly how the event works. You can get yourself as prepared as possible. And then you're going to have... The best day ever on the 24th when Jingle arrives. Um, and then on the 31st is obviously New Year's Eve. So there'll be an event and festivities in the plaza area for that as well. I think there's also some fireworks which will be pretty cool. So yeah, pretty jam-packed in terms of stuff that is making an appearance this month. But you know guys, it's going to be super, super fun. So another item that we want to touch on is if we're going to our Nook shopping and across to our seasonal items, you can see there's two seasonal items available. So you've got the Aurora Wall, and I think this is absolutely ridiculous, like insane, and I cannot wait to use it. I've got a really cool idea to use it, so I'm really excited to show you that. And then you've also got this midwinter sweater as well, which is for the winter solstice. So both of those are available till the end of December in your seasonal section of Nook Shopping. Now, the other things you've probably noticed by now, but they are just little minor things that I want to kind of touch on, is in the Nook's Cranny, there is a new seasonal item section. And these are the toys that have come with the Toy Day event. So it's these ones here. And if you talk to your islanders between now and and the 24th, they will probably start to give you hints on what they want. So take note of what they're saying they want, try and buy it, and then that way, 
when it comes round to 24, you've got presents for everybody. You've got exactly what they want. And then the final thing for this month is obviously now we've moved into winter um, and we're making our way up to Christmas. If you go into the Able Sisters, you'll see there's a bit more kind of winter clothing and kind of festive clothing as well. So you can see today I've got these kind of like cool jumpers. I've got some holiday sweaters. And there's also been the kind of Santa outfits that have been circulating in Nooks as well. So keep an eye in Mabel Sisters as well. So keep an eye out um, every day. See what comes, especially if you're looking for one of those festive costumes. But otherwise, I think that is us done for December. I mean, like I said, pretty jam-packed month. And I will definitely be doing more videos specifically talking about the seasonal DIYs and the seasonal materials and the festive 24th jingle toy day event so look out for those videos and i'll just break those down in more detail but that's everything you need to know for december so let me know in the comments what are you most excited about and as always guys we're doing daily videos so hit that subscribe button drop a like and i will see you tomorrow bye guys